G'day, I am Alistair Christie, and I am pleased to announce the availability of part two in the series Building Applications in Delphi using the Visual Component Library. Within uh, 24 hours of me sending out the announcement to the um, people who purchased part one, um, just under half purchased part two, and um, since then, a few others, there's been a few more people buying it, so I'm um, now uh, over half the people who bought part one have, have bought part two, which is a, a very good sign. Uh, it would, indicates to me that the, uh, the content is worth, worthwhile and, and people uh, find it very useful. Uh, you might too, so you can head over to learndelphi.tv and buy yourself a copy, or two, or get part one and part two. So um, let's uh, now take a quick look at uh, what this video contains. So I have here a copy of um, both part one and part two. Um, these have both been downloaded from Share It. This is exactly what you get um, when you buy it. Uh, there's no DRM, they're completely um, uh, pr protection free, so you can uh, um, do whatever you want to convert them to whatever you want to play on um, various devices. They should, they should play on in most things. They'll, they'll play in Windows Media Player and QuickTime. Um, my uh, player of choice is uh, VLC, which you can get from videoland.org. Um, so if I start part two up, and oops, size that down a bit. Um, so the first thing I decreased the quality somewhat uh, to drop it down. So this one was um, sort of 510 megabytes, and this one's 417. So I've um, knocked down uh, about 100 megabytes off the file size. Um, the other thing I've added is chapters. So these work in uh, VLC, but don't seem to work in Windows Media Player or QuickTime. So it's an MP4 file which, which supports chaptering. So um, you can move the, the mouse along and it'll tell you the chapter, or um, we can skip to, to various chapters. Uh, oops. And so on. And we can look at the, the uh, various components. So this this makes it a lot easier to uh, if you're wanting to look back for something, um, an easy way to do it. Um, so there's a, a status bar, and let's zoom along a little bit. Um, also, you can also one thing I do like about VLC is uh, in playback there is speed, and you can uh, make it faster or slower. Um, it's easier to use the keyboard uh, shortcuts, which are the square brackets. So right spread bracket makes it go faster, and left slower. slower. So um, if you I, people complain that I talk too fast, which is probably true, um, so you can actually uh, slow my speech rate down to below my uh, normal cadence. So this is sort of at eighty percent. Or if you're a, a speed listener like myself, I, I tend to watch other people's videos sort of at one point seven times. Um, I was reviewing uh, my videos sort of at double speed or even triple speed when I was uh, just wanting to make sure it quickly go through it and, and verify that it was going okay. So um, I probably don't need to say uh, anything else, so I will uh, stop there and uh, you can head across to learndelphi.tv and buy a copy of um, part one or and or part two. Um, thanks for watching.